ladies and gentlemen, the king of the derps, Slow King. Anyway, hello everyone and welcome back to more Pokemon Stadium 2! In the last episode, we destroyed Pretty Boy Falconer's life and then we did another battle in the Challenge Cup. And speaking of Challenge Cup, that's what we're doing today! We're going to be doing Challenge Cup, hopefully get some more battles out of the way, and then next episode we're going to take on the next gym in Jameer Castle. So let's jump right into Challenge Cup, battle number 3. Look at that rocket, he's like, ugh, I lost! It feels wonderful to battle Pokemon outside! Alright, what do you got? I just realized the thing. Almost her entire team is weak to electric and ice. Well, actually, her whole team is weak to electric ice. So line up. Well, actually, everything except the freaking polywag. So I need to bring Magnemite and Swine up. Because these two alone just murder her whole team. I swear, so far, Spiro has not had any usage. I'll bring Master Derp, because Master Derp can find work too. As long as she has a big polywag. Zubat? That is perfect. Let's go for that nice and clean, icy wind. Wind of ice. Nice and icy. How do we outspeed? It's a fucking Zubat. Zubat's supposed to be like ridiculously fast. See how much is done. Ooh, that does a lot. Oh, it's speed is that does a lot. Still wing! What will the trainer do now? He appears to be impervious to damage. Oh my god, Wooly! You just it's ate the Rollberry to restore its HP. What? A hot you have a gold berry? What? Why does he get a gold berry? What a dick! You know I have. I realize now I didn't even look at the items my Pokemon have. You went with two? Are you fucking serious? Stealing. How much is this gonna do now? What's this? Don't fret. that attack just bounced off. Good work, boy. What do we got to finish this off? I only have Icy Wind to attack this thing with because it's part flying, so Mud Slap doesn't work. That kind of sucks. Dead. Alright, so who's next to get his ass erect? What Pokemon will the Lissa? Okay, who is it? Oh, it's Polywag! Fucking <laughs> Frick Fricks. Fucking Frick Fricks. Alright, I think we need to switch into Master Derp. Master Derp is gonna take whatever this thing's gonna do, and it's more than likely gonna go for a water move. That's like the blatant play. It's gonna go for a water move, just watch. Master Derp will swallow this. Waterfall, yep. I'm gonna swallow this. What now? Uh, Look at that damage! That did nothing! Master Derp is a god! His derpiness is just magnificent! Toxic! Nasty toxic! The poison will steadily weaken the victim! Frick! That's actually a good play. Let's see how much it does. Cause look at all the HP Slowpoke has! It'll stay on the field for a while. Unless you toxic it. The white hot battle I mean, continues. now you can probably just switch out into your next Pokemon and then stall me out. Oh my god! Are you serious? It's actually a stall set! It's actually a stall set! I need to switch out next turn! If this thing doesn't die, I had to switch out. I had to go into Magnemite next turn. Because I can't take too much poison damage, my slow poke will die. That's gonna do nothing. Nothing and a half. Please kill it. Wait for seven. Yeah, you definitely cannot stay in. I guess we It's gonna go for a waterfall anyway. And if I had stood in, I wouldn't have lived another toxic turn. Waterfall would have done enough so that toxic would kill. Oh, and this isn't Gen 1, so you still take weak. poison damage between what turns. Opportunity. What's this? That was blow. All right, Magnemite, please tell me you have something. You got Swift. You got Rollout, too. You got Swagger. Wish I knew that five minutes ago. You outspeed my Magnemite! How's that? That did little damage. 
I really should have set a sunny day. Now that I realize it. You're dead anyway. So bye. Bye! Catch that! You know, the comic question should probably be what well, you your opinion is on Stall. I hate Stall more than anything. Stall is like my least favorite type of strat. That's a hop it. I can't switch into Master Jerk. Uh, everyone is at decently low HP, so I'm gonna go into Swine Up. But anyway, as I was saying, I hate Stall with a passion. Glyscore, Manibuzz, Skarm, I hate those kinds of Pokemon. Like, RU's here! RU's- Oh, shit! Oh, no. It was a- <laughs> Are you serious? I'm sorry, Wooly! If I had known it was gonna get a crit, why would you go- You predicted my play. You would not go for- In a competitive battle, you would not go for a Giga Drain on a Steel type. That would be a ridiculously retarded play. I need to go for a Swagger Because Thunder won't kill. It's neutral. And I don't trust Rollout. I'm faster than it. Oh my god, am I really gonna lose? What not? That does no damage. That does no damage. Please hit a Thunder Magnemite. There we go. How much is it going to do? Oh my god. Oh my god! Never mind. I underestimated you, Magnemite. Good work, bro. Kinda sucks I had to get Wooly killed off, assuming I could actually live whatever this thing was gonna go for. Not predicting Giga Drain. That was a stupid play on my part. I should have expected it to go for some kind of grass move. But I was thinking, no, it's not gonna go for a grass move on a Magnemite. That's stupid. Only an idiot would do that. And clearly, the Pokeball bots are idiots! I let my guitar do the talk. I'll rock and roll right over you. Anyway. Oh my god, the grass pad is too real. Ugh. Ugh. What? Okay, let me take a look at this human book. Half grass, half electric. Why does this remind me of something? But anyway, Wooly destroys this entire team single handedly. Massacres. I'm bringing Wooly. And for once, Spiro. Spiro can actually put in the work. What's your speed? You have a mystery berry. You know, let's take an opportunity. You have the. No wonder you're thunder killed. Okay. What do you only have? Mint berry. I'm pretty sure that heals sleep. Bell has miracle seed for grass. What do you have? Oh! Master Derp has the mystic water. And you have the. <laughs> That's a good joke. You know what? I can actually use Slugma. I can actually use Slugma. Slugma! You're gonna get screen time! I'm gonna use Spiro, I'm gonna use Slugma, let's do it. Time to beat the guitars there. And music hit. change. This is round four. Mm. Alright, who's first? Hop it again! I don't know if I outspeed it. I don't know if I'll die at full. I'm actually gonna go for detectives. Just for like, you know. I'm gonna go for detect and you know check to see what's gonna do. Stun spore. What? A stun spore class. Oh, that's a miss. Okay. A hot battle is unfolding. We're gonna go for icy wind because it's quad read to ice, and this is stab. So let's see if this kills. And judging from the announcer, that's gonna kill. Thank you, announcer. Like, if the announcer actually says the name of the attack, it's more than likely going to kill. Who's next? Bulbasaur? Okay, Bulbasaur. I'm gonna switch into Slugma. This might be a bad idea, but I think this thing's gonna go for some bullshit grass move on me. And I don't want Wooly dying again. I want as many continues as I can get for the last few battles. Because 
The last two battles are actually hard. Giga Drain, yup, I was right to predict that switch. Yeah, Slugman's special defense ain't that good. I should have taken less Pokemon damage than that. Let's go for a Fire Blast. And I clicked the wrong move. What a headbutt! That did a lot more. Am I getting flinched? I'm getting flinched. King's Rock Bulbasaur, anyone? King's Rock Pedro? I think it's King Rock Pedro. That's doing that a lot. Really I need dead. to switch out. Please don't get flinched again. Fire Blast landing. Good, fire blast. No, of course I don't! We need to switch. We need to go in Spiro. Okay. I can't take another freaking headbutt or I'll die. Here comes the Pokemon switch. Oh, it's Spiro! Ah. Alright, let, let's see how much this does. What will it do? A light pack. Eh, doesn't do as much as it did the slug. What impact will this Pokemon switch have on the battle? Uh, we could always set up. We could always set up and go for curse. But I'm not going to risk that. I'm gonna go for pack right now. Damage is damage. Attack. That had to hurt. Wow, that, that must have hurt. That was like a freaking needle to the face. What's this? The hit plant right off. All right. Go for another one. Pretty sure this is like a three hit KO. Unless it crit. Yep, it's three hit KO. And Giga Drain. Don't do this! That's a bad move! Okay, never mind. That did a lot. That's a part. You can please go suck a dick somewhere in hell, you. Ugh, why would you have a gold berry tone, you ass hat? Alright, we need to go for pack again. I don't think it's gonna kill now because it's that full enough HP oh, that can. Go. A powerful blow. Frank. Headbutt, I'm dead. There's the attack. That did little. Oh my god, it's Bill Nine! It doesn't oh, have a berry oh, anymore, so it's dead! Bye! It's a swift attack! Swift never misses, so suck it! Alright, who would he bring next? If it's something that Wooly can't kill, we're screwed. Pichu, Wooly can destroy this thing! Wooly can destroy this thing, we win. Okay, let's switch to Wooly. Shut up, announcer! Oh my god, I feel like I'm playing ORS right now. T Wave. This shouldn't work because I'm grounded. Doesn't no affect Swine Up! Yep, I was right. They fixed that logic in this game. And I, I outspeed a Pichu. Let's go. Ice and Axe! That did a lot from Mud Slap. We saw how pathetic the damage Mud Slap did last episode. Look how much. Are you serious? What now? That should mess. It missed! No, that didn't connect. They're both hanging tough. Bye, Pichu! You're a Pikachu ripoff because you have Iron Tail. Bye! Dead! Nice and 3 0. That settles this battle. Nice and easy. Watch, that wasn't exactly easy. I did have to make some careful plays. Well, we got through that completely unscathed. Look at how badly Spear and Slugma got destroyed. Oh my god. I'll just go home and work in a ballad. Yeah, you do that, buddy. Let's go on to battle number five. We have three continues. We could have had four! If I didn't make a bad play! Oh my god, that guy's Sprite. Some fishmen have no patience at all. Hurry up already! Holy shit, this team is water type to water type to water type to water type. Boyton Magnemite use, let's go. Boyton Bellsprout use, let's go. And. Drip King. He has Sunny Day, so he can kind of negate water damage. And then just confusion everything to death. Will these fries turn into roars of victory? Round 5 begins now. Goldie. 
If this thing gets hit by thunder, it's dead. I will fry this fish so hard it's faster. Here's the first move. Oh look, a move that Colleen and Sea King only had in Gen 1 because Waterfall didn't exist yet. Here it comes! What fish anyone? Dead Goldie! Nice and magnet! And it literally dies! That's a bit morbid. I fried it so bad it died. Oh, it's shoulder! Okay, Shelter, it's physically bulky, but that's all it's really got going for it. Doesn't get shell smashed this gen, so you can catch a thunder and die! And it has that nice and clean 69 HP. Bye! It was a crit too, oh my god! Magnemite, you need to turn now! You need to just turn down, Magnemite. We don't need you, like, completely annihilating everything. Turn dial. Down to the last Pokemon. Alright, as long as the thing doesn't do me, they have to kill me. I, win. I outspeed a Toradile, let's go. Will this do it? Is... Oh my god! Magnemite, you need to turn down! Stop! Just stop! It's the not that Pokemon serious, bro! It's not that serious, bro! You need to murder this Pokemon! Jesus! He's like a fucking psychopath right now. He just went ham on that team! Two crits in a row, my god, Magnemite! You need to stop! I'm sorry for insulting you earlier. I don't think I did insult you anyway, but... God! Just, just stop! Anyway, battle number six. I don't know if, like, Magneton is stalling or something. Because I've never used a Magneton before. Um... What? What is this lady saying? Okay, now we're getting into... Oh, wow, she has three of our Pokemon. Okay, looking at this team... Ooh, okay, now we're getting into some pretty tricky territory. She has two Pokémon weak to grass, but she has the Slugma and the Execute to resist grass. What do you have on your set, Mouse Pad? No, I don't want to... You got Acid. Acid for the Execute, but you can't exactly take a Psychic. Plus, there's the Drowsy, and... I have no dark moves at all. So that kind of sucks. Because in this gen, because bug moves still suck, the only real weakness for psychic types is dark. And dark moves are kind of bad because they're all special. So special walls kind of still take it well. Okay, let's see. We have two psychic types, but executes part grass. Swine up is weak to a lot of things. Only one... No, your water psychic. Okay, this is gonna be quite decisive. I think I need to bring... Master Derp. I'm gonna bring Bellsprout. In case of the Slowpoke or the Swinub. And I'm going to bring Swinub. In case the Mareep comes. Round six is about to get underway. Many trainers have fallen by the wayside, leaving just eight to reach the quarterfinals. Swine lead. That is perfect unless she switches out. Even though I know for sure we don't outspeed it, we will live anything this thing wants to do. Yeah, that's why I know. Look at that swagger. Oh, its confusion made it tougher. Good work, Master Jerk! Not even confused, you can stop this man! Dang! Mystic Water stabs Surf from a Slowpoke on a Swine Up? That's not gonna live it no matter what you think. That was just too quick! Will this turn into a one sided battle? Alright, who's next? Oh, it's Marie! Well, easy, good thing I brought the Swine Up. Speaking of Swine Up, let's switch into her right now. I don't want to be confused, Slowpoke. Because just imagine how much an electric attack would do to a Slowpoke. Probably a lot, because it's supposed to be physically bulky. Thunder, yup. Perfect switch. How's that? That 
had no effect. All right, good. Let's go for that nice clean mud slap. Get some damage off of this thing. I outspeed it, so by accuracy. That did it, not much, but it doesn't even matter. We lower accuracy no matter what. Accuracy is I love that indefinite accuracy lowering. Swagger. What's this? Oh, that's it missed. It, Swagger isn't even a bad it's thing on Swino. Tough. Because we're part... Ground is physical this gen, so... Our mud slash will just be doing more with the risk of us being There's able to hit ourselves in confusion. That's a four-hit oh. KO. Unless you have a berry or some bullshit. What now? Oh, that oh my god, accuracy is so low. The white it's gonna miss like every single shot. Catch these mud slap, brah! What'll it do? It appears to be impervious to damage. It, announcer, it's almost dead. It has 19 HP and it's minus three further. accuracy. It's not gonna do much to me. Unless watch just one land. Oh, Never mind. Again. Bye, Mick. Uh, Bye, Marie. Nice knowing you, buddy. Catch his mud slaps. What's next? Right. That's a hit. Oh, and down it goes. There's only one Pokemon left. Come out. Oh, it's Slugma! Slugma? We have to switch to Master Derp. Like, I, it's not that I don't trust using Swine up against this thing, because I can just mud slap it like I did the Mareep, but I don't want to risk getting hit by a Fire Blast and dying. As I said before, I want as many continues as I can possibly get. So, switching into Master Derp is probably the optimal play. What's this? Because his attack stat is already absolute garbage. So, I don't even think it matters if he takes a freaking confusion hit or two. Even at plus two, I don't think it'll matter much. I hit myself. Look at that, that wasn't even much. Body slam. He's probably gonna parry. How did I predict the hacks? How did I predict the hacks? And you saw how- There's the Fire Blast. That's gonna do, like, nothing. It's resisted. Not that actually did decent damage. Uh -huh. Confusion's if off! You You're dead! That's it. That's it was a- Oh my god! Master Jerp! I know you're salty and all! You don't have to murder it that bad! No Jesus! Magnum and Master Jerp are just, like, salty! He's just salty as hell right now. Look at him! You can see how pissed off he is. That swagger just made him like ultra salty. And that medium, Peggy is like pissed off. And the road to glory stretches fine. Well, you can say that in the loser's corner. We're gonna do battle seven right now. This is probably gonna be like prime time like prediction thinking. Because this battle's actually pretty hard. I did this before in my practice run. I went. I didn't do the whole game for the practice run. I only did like. What? What the hell? Where's my for Pokemon? There. Oh no! It's a fucking ditto. This is mono normal. It's mono normal, but the only problem is she brought a ditto. And there's a hoot hoot, so I may need to bring Magnemite. If I'm gonna bring Magnemite though, I need to bring Swine up and Slowpoke, because that's the only way I'm gonna counter the ditto if it's brought. That's like the ultimate method of countering Ditto. Bringing Pokemon that will be able to counteract Ditto, whatever Ditto transforms into. So we're gonna go with Magnemite, Swine Up, and Max Burger. So the two salty ass team members, and then we'll leave. It should lead with the Ditto. We're gonna have to switch out right now. Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? Are you serious? Why are you leading with this? Command Why are you main. leading with this? You have takedown. This is gonna do like nothing to me. Here's the first move. Look at that! That did nothing. Ah, that didn't do much. Why? Why are you leading with this? Why are you leading with this? Catch this thunder! You're dead. Thunder. I know you're especially bulky and all, but nope, you're dead. Bye. See you in hell. Good games.
Adios! Hasta la vista! Many other words that mean goodbye! Why? Ditto? Jigglypuff. This thing has a lot of HP. I don't know what it wants to do to me. I don't speed it. There it goes! That does a lot. Oh, it went to three and it's going for strength. What's damage? <laughs> What's damage to a Magnemite? You're dead. Bye. I think I know what this episode's gonna be titled. Ditto? I knew it! I feel like out of all my team members, I should switch and just line it. Wait, what do you have for those? All out smackers. We're gonna switch and slide it. This strategy is full. Here comes a Pokemon switch. I just realized we have rollout too, so either way, this oh, ditto is dead. Mm. Transform. Oh wow! It transformed! Alright, into Mass will this Pokemon switch have on the battle? Countering Ditto is like oh, the easiest thing in the universe Pokemon in this game when you have Pokemon that are able to counter each other. Oh, it's Slowpoke! So, just to know for anyone, if you want to counter a Ditto, bring Pokémon that can counter each other. It's not very effective. Like how I brought Magnemite to deal with Swinub. I, I mean, like how I brought Slowpoke that can... Brought Swinub that can wall Thunder from Magnemite. Slowpoke can pretty much wall the hell out of Swinub and kill it with Surf. And Swinub can destroy Magnemite. So, it's like a triangular counter strike. Or however I should try to say it. Master Derp is just a god of taking hits right now. And you're dead, so bye! Ditto counters FTW! It was a- Master Derp! Master Derp! Please, please just stop. Please, please stop. You're just- You're just so fucking salty! Stop being salty! God damn! I know you're pissed off and all, but Jesus! And what the hell? The actual Ditto sprite isn't even there. That is so funny. <laughs> so there are kids like you. Well, yes, there are. Anyway, that shall be it for today's episode of Pokemon Stadium 2. We just murdered the hell out of everybody in the grandmother. And next time on Pokemon Stadium 2. We will be taking on Azalea Gym, and we will be finishing up Challenge Cup Pokeball. Common question today is, this is mostly directed towards competitive players because we're the ones who actually deal with stall teams and use stall teams. So, what are your opinions on stall teams? Like, teams that are just designed to sit there, bulk your hits, and drain your HP while they just, like, sub, protect, and wish, and all that jazz. And I will see you guys next time.